Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. So in today's video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run the Geekbench 3 benchmarking tool which measures the processor and memory performance uh, between the iPhone 5, the iPhone 5S and the HTC One. So uh, just to show you guys, there's nothing running in the background. All clear. Double tap. All clear. Okay, so we're going to run, uh, let's go to the Geekbench 3. Geekbench 3 and Geekbench 3. Okay, so just to give you a quick overview, we've got an A6 processor here clocked at 1.3 gigahertz and it's a dual core processor. It's got 1 gigabytes of DDR2 RAM. This guy has a A7 processor clocked at 1.3 gigahertz and it has 1 gigabytes of RAM. This is also a dual core processor and it's the 64-bit chip okay so this is a 32-bit processor this is a 64-bit processor and then we've got the HTC one which is a snapdragon processor clocked at 1.7 gigahertz it's a quad core processor and it's got 2 gigabytes of RAM and it also has a 32-bit chip for the processor so let's run the benchmark and see how they fare Okay, so all three of these phones are done. As you can see, the iPhone 5S leads the pack. It's twice as fast as the iPhone 5, and it's faster than the HTC One. And also, it is interesting to note that the iPhone 5 has a faster single-core uh, performance than the HTC One. However, HTC One is better than the iPhone 5 in a dual-core, I mean, I mean multi-core operation iPhone 5S is the clear winner, HTC leads in second, and iPhone 5 is in fact history. Alright, so that brings us to the end of this video. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video. And also you can go ahead and connect with me socially on Google+, Facebook, and Twitter, for which all the links are in the description below. Thank you again, and I'll see you the next time. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, just throw them down in the comments section below.